This is vibes, this is life, this is travel. Okay, so it's day three for us. We arrived on Wednesday and it's now Friday. So Wednesday was mostly just settling in, just chilling at the hostel. Yesterday was at the Africa Fashion Show, so they won. Uh, for us but it was actually the second day of the fashion show yesterday on Thursday and so we're gonna go back my, Malika and myself we're gonna go back today for what will be day two for us but day three of the fashion show and the final day of the fashion show so there's also the after party so that should be cool to check out so we're at Teddy's corner near Central Station in Amsterdam getting some breakfast it looks pretty decent so it's seven euros for a full English breakfast which comes with two eggs, two bacon, uh, two sausages, Heinz beans, hash brown, two toast with butter and jam. Looking forward to it. It's myself, Malachi, Dan and Mad here. Dan and Mad are two guys, two Canadian cool dudes who we met um, in, the, in the hostel. We've been hanging out with them in central Amsterdam at the moment. Looking forward to this food. We're super hungry. It's what, coming up to 11.30 and we haven't had breakfast yet. Yeah, you can imagine that we're quite hungry. Yeah, we're looking forward to, to tucking into some food. Okay, so to introduce everyone, this is Dan. How's it going? He's from uh, Toronto, Canada. Yeah. Malachi, my friend, we've already met. He's from Switzerland, uh, but originally from Cameroon. This is Raz. Uh, what he spends with uh, Dan, both from Toronto, Canada. Yeah, really cool dudes. Yeah. Food has come, and check it out. Like, it's pretty amazing. Like, Ooh wee, that is a meal and a half. I'm about to tuck in. Bon appetit. All right, so we finished in the, well, breakfast place, Teddy's Corner. It was really, really good. I mean, amazing. The hash browns were delicious. I mean, absolutely delicious. So if you come to Amsterdam uh, around Central Station, we recommend Teddy's. It was seven euros for full English breakfast, two eggs, two uh, bacons, hash brown, two sausages, baked beans, jam, butter, two slices of bread, delicious. Recommend Teddy's Corner. Come here, check it out, get good value for your money. So yeah, we're just gonna go around the city center now, have some fun. So we're just entering the shop now, we're gonna check out some souvenirs. Have a lot of cameras, no guy? Yeah, do you do uh, yeah. something for YouTube? Or yeah, like yeah, this? we're doing that. We're trying yeah, to. Yeah, you have yeah. to pay me five euros for a video on the video. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> no, it's a joke. It's a joke. The first one is for free. Thank you. But it's gonna turn into a crazy shop. So she's just telling us that the shop is being renovated and it's gonna look completely different when it's done. So what, what kind of things are you changing? What kind of things are you adding and so on? Uh, yeah, we're gonna do basically a psychedelic decoration. Psychedelic decoration. Yeah, we're gonna okay. create a concert which is like a festival, okay. but inside the shop. We're gonna do crazy stuff. You've seen from the footage, we did some sightseeing in central Amsterdam 
and now we're back at the Koning for the fashion show. Saturday, day four. We arrived here on Wednesday. Wednesday, we mostly just chilled. Thursday, we went to the fashion show. Friday, we went to the fashion show. It's Saturday now. We're just doing some typical sightseeing in the, in Amsterdam. So today is the Botanical Gardens. It's a beautiful Botanical Gardens. I definitely recommend it if you come to uh, Amsterdam. So it was raining a lot before, but now it's not raining. The sun's out. So yeah, let me just show you a bit of what it looks like. There's some lilies in the pond in the back behind me. This is the oval garden, amazing, amazing gardens. Definitely recommend that you come see the beauty of nature if you come to Amsterdam. So yeah, the gardens, just brief to the point. We're at a flea market near the botanical gardens. So Let you guys check it out, see what you think. Let's see. Yep. Let's see this masterpiece. Woo! He reps Amsterdam. Yep. You know it. Repping to the max. <laughs> okay, so we're at a restaurant called Lime Leaf. We brought our ticket for the canal cruise, but it's not until 5.15. So we're just gonna get some food in the meantime. Going to get some pho or pho, depending on how you pronounce it. Uh, <laughs> look at these guys <laughs> laughing. They're the ones who started the debate. In the UK we say pho, PHO we say pho. We're gonna get some pho. These guys uh, from Canada say it's far. Uh, Comment section below, let uh, us know. Is it far or is it far? Uh, okay, cool. Yes. All right. Here we go, enjoy it. Thank you. Okay. So the food has come and look at this. I mean, golly. Bring yours closer, dude. Cheese. Yeah, this is quite a shot. Look at this. This is a meal and a half. So we've got three Vietnamese bowl noodles with beef. So myself, Rad, and Dan's. Yeah. Oh, look at all that. Malachi got what? Tori katsu? This looks the best. Yeah. Uh, then so there's a lamb so. fold. And then what's your starter? Oh, this is Korean beef tacos. Korean beef tacos. I mean, amazing. Jeez. We are going to enjoy this. I'm going to put this on the table so you can see my impression while I eat it. Because who doesn't want to see somebody eat food and rate it at the same time? So, yeah. Everybody I'm about to dive in. Oh, okay. Chopstick fork, what's your preference? I'm having the vlog <laughs> vlogged. Like, this is interesting. Vlog exception. Oh, I actually need some. Uh, I need some. Indoors. <laughs> He's a cool guy, alright? He's a cool guy. Anyway, let's. <laughs> I'm talking to the YouTube world and the world in general and the universe. Anyway, here goes. First impression. Mmm. 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 Yes. Yes. Mmm. Yes. Mmm. Definitely recommend this. Definitely recommend if you come to um, Amsterdam and you're looking for a decent or good full place. Yep, definitely come to Lime Leaf. So yeah, I'm going to enjoy this, the rest of it's off camera, but it's definitely great, delicious, delic, as a friend of mine would say, delic. Okay, so we're at the Amsterdam Canal Cruises, waiting for the cruise, which is at 5.15. It's been a pretty full and busy day. So yeah, there it is right there. This is where you come to buy tickets. Yeah, it's been a pretty wet day, so that's why everyone's in these uh, ponchos, waterproof ponchos. Should be fun. I love saying it should be fun. You know what, fun is what we aim for, right? 
I will take some more videos when we are on the actual cruise. Come to Plek, at which we could get to by the free ferry. We can see the sunset. Behind us is the sand at Fleck. Look, Plek. So look at this. That's P L L E K. Check this out. This was all free to get to from Central Station. And look at the view behind us. Look at this view. We've got sand. We have sea. We have food. What more do you need? A free concert going on in the back. You can hear Jay Huss, uh, Mr. Easy's meant to be there, a whole bunch of people. This is vibes, this is life, this is travel. Alright, so it's the last day. We've checked out of the hostel. We've had breakfast. So we're about to head off. It's been a great trip so far. I definitely recommend if you wanted to come to Amsterdam to stay at via Amsterdam Hostel. If you're if you don't mind staying at hostels, you, you're alright with meeting new people. The facilities here are fantastic. Every evening they had activities from silent disco to uh, limbo, all kinds of stuff. So definitely uh, if you come to Amsterdam and you're looking for a place to stay. Uh, via Amsterdam is pretty chill. It's the last day now. Don't have that much planned. My flight's at 8 in at tonight and it's now uh, what 15 past 11 in the morning so still have a good while to go before I have to get my flight. I might do the bus tour so the hop on hop off bus and then aside from that might go to the souvenir shop buy some souvenirs. We'll see. Sad to, to say goodbye to the hostel, sad to, to sign out and, and to going back to the UK a bit. But I'm looking forward to sleeping in my bed again, so that'll be fun. Okay, so I did the bus tour. Something interesting happened. I ended up falling asleep. So, unfortunately, there's no footage. After that, I thought to myself, I just spent 15 euros to do the bus tour, which I didn't see any of because I fell asleep. What can I do that I'm actually going to really enjoy? So, I thought, what do I enjoy doing? Eating food. And what food do I really enjoy eating? Nigerian food. So, I've come to a Nigerian restaurant. It's called Obalade. I think in English people probably say it's Obalade, but uh, it's a Yoruba word, which is one of the languages of uh, Nigeria, Yoruba. Um, so yeah, it's Obalade. Okay, so one of the things I ordered was suya, and the suya has come. Check this out. So it's beef, uh, strips of beef, fried or so, but it's really, really nice. Mmm, so good. So it's got this kind of pepper sauce right here. It's a little hot, which is good. I like it hot. Okay, so the rest of the food has come. And here is the jell-off with plantain. You can see it's a good portion, which is good. Because I'm sure you can see I like my food. And so, yes, a good portion of food, which is fantastic. So jell-off and plantain. So jell-off is a spicy red rice. It's cooked in tomato stew with a lot of spices. Um, so the rice is cooked in the tomato stew with lots of spices and this is fried plantain and then this is moi moi so it's a it's a bean cake very tasty very healthy good for your health uh, definitely recommend it if you ever go to a nigerian restaurant so i've got the moi moi i've got the rice jello rice and plantain fried plantain and i have the the suya so it's time to tuck in Mm. So good, mm. so good. So it's about 10 past 6 and I'm at the airport 
flight is at 10 to 8. I'm actually super tired. I think the food gave me the itis. So I'm ready to sleep. I fell asleep on the train to get to the airport. Yeah, um, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, do subscribe if you'd like to. You can also follow me on Instagram at Universe of Corriday, and that'll be linked in the description for the video. See you again.